Welcome to my backyard picnic bench. As fall comes, it's getting more and more comfortable. So what we're doing today, I'm gonna to test out some equipment before we take it out in the field. Um, I hope you, hope you like this bench because you're gonna be seeing a lot of it in these videos. <laughs> it's gonna be my test bench before I take things out in the field. All right, so what I'm testing out is this Hellcraft AX1. I think that's what it is, AX1 or AT1, something like that. And it is the most simple antenna I have. That's why I got it. So basically it's got 20 and 17 meters. I'm just doing 20 today. It has one counterpoise, which I may add to right now. I'm, I just uh, I want to test this out and see what it's going to do. And I'm very, very, not very hopeful that it's going to actually make a contact. So we're at 14068. Hit OK. Looks like we got um, 2.9. Let's see if we go up. It's going down. How low can we get it? So it's resonant now at 14.5. 14.5. So it's way off, but I probably can do something to fix that. Let's give that a try. I'm going to go change the antenna and see if we can get that. Okay, so the best I could get it was 2.5. I even put a different, a different counterpoise on there. Almost feel like if I push the telescoping part down, the SWR goes up. I feel like if it could go even higher, which is can't because it's maxed out, then I could get the SWR lower. I'll call. So I'm at 2.6 SWR. 14068. And let's hit the tuner. And we're at 10 to 1. Okay, we had to tune it. But I'm going to call CQ and see if, if I either hear anything or I think I'm at 10 watts. 5 watts. So I'll go up to 10. I'm going to check the reverse beacon network. See if we got anything. Okay, now i got to go get my phone, which I don't have with me. I don't hear any activity out here. It's 20 meters and it is getting later in the evening, so it's probably not doing so well. Let's go get my phone. I called CQ twice, got my phone. We're gonna go to Reverse Beacon Network. N9YO. Search. All right. Look at that. Let's see, is that today? Today is the 16th. So, it looks like the top one, two, three, four, five, the top five heard me at 10 decibels, 10 decibels, eight, eight, and three decibels. That's pretty good. You know, if I use that wire over there, it would do much better, but considering that little tiny antenna and how easy it is to deploy, that's I'm pretty happy with that. Uh, I just wanted to test it and make sure it works. Was hoping to get a one, one to zero, one to one. But anyway, let's call CQ just for the heck of it. I don't expect anyone to come back. It's getting late at night. You know, it's funny there's an alert system out there I forget what the website is but you can be alerted when people call CQ and I'll get people messaging me like hey are you on the air like yeah well kind of I mean I doubt you'll be able to talk to me because I'm QRP and I'm experimenting but 
I am out there. Okay, so let's search around and see if we can hear any activity at all. Yeah, I don't I didn't expect any. Let's go to I know that antenna is not for 40 meters, but let's just go and see what happens. See if we can hear anything. Now, I'm just curious. That antenna is not built for 40 meters, but will it tune? It's a very good tuner in in this one one to one, man. All right, let's call CQ and see if I'm heard on 40 meters. With an a, a antenna that is not built for 40 meters. Now let's see if I was heard to hit refresh. No, it looks like I did not show up on here. Need your, I bet he says call sign, call, need your call. Man, that's loud and clear. All right, guys, that's it. I think it's a su successful test. I just got to figure out, I just got to figure out how to make that resonant. And I don't know how to without having a longer telescoping because changing out the counterpoise did not change the SWR. Mm -hmm.